Hey guys, today we're going to review yet another website. Um, and my name is Thomas, website designer. And I'm Bakita, the website copywriter. Yep, so today we're going to review Share Your Bottom. And I've actually seen Share on YouTube and also LinkedIn. Um, I think she's far more popular on LinkedIn um, that she's on YouTube. And yeah, so let's get started. So I think the number one thing is actually what I just closed. At least she has that little pop-up to try and get guys to subscribe to her newsletter. And also another thing I noticed, like as soon as I opened is you actually see her, you know, um, see her face right there. Um, and she kind of draws you in and makes you feel like you're in the right place. Yeah, what do you think? I think also that it, I don't know, it's nice. I like the photography. Yeah, it's yeah, very beautiful. Yeah. Yes. And also her call to action. I love it. Click here to learn how to dominate LinkedIn. I like mm, that. Yeah. And also it's clear. Who is she? Are you in the right place? And then what do you want? Do you want to dominate LinkedIn? I mm, love that. Yeah. That's fantastic. Mm -hmm. It is clear. It is clear what she's offering. It is clear what she's, the pain point she's touching on. Yeah. That's good. Mm. And also she's just using her own personal brand. So it's everywhere. So it's pretty clear um, basically what it is about. I don't know what's going on here. Are you here for, and there's a huge photo that doesn't end. I think there's a problem with the design here because it's a pretty, a bit messy there. So anyway, LinkedIn video bootcamp, okay. Okay, features, pictures, events, podcasts, and the show robot on show. Uh, okay, I think the website started really well and then suddenly got a bit messy going down here because suddenly we see the LinkedIn video bootcamp and I'm guessing that's one of our call to actions. So either you're joining the bootcamp or you want to watch her show, or you want to check out her events, podcasts, and stuff. And this seems to be going to some form. Hmm. Or maybe it's um, maybe it's a form to book her. Ah, hire her for speeches and stuff. Okay, that wasn't very clear, but yeah. <laughs> and then also you've got the show and I'm not totally sure why it's designed like this. And then of course you have the focused on getting into her newsletter. Now, the one thing I can say she's doing really well, I guess is that she has a bunch of offers. Yes. Um, so I you land there and there's a whole bunch of offers to, yeah. to get I think you somewhere. Maybe what has happened is she started well, we're like, mm. wow, we get it. Yeah. But after that, we're lost. As you can to, see, we're lost. Yeah. We're lost. Yeah. Um, Yes. Hmm. I think we need, I think what's going on here is we need one thing that's one happening. Offer. Yeah. Because from the very beginning, I liked how she said, to learn how to dominate LinkedIn. I think for me, that oriented me very well. Mm -hmm. I was like, if I want to dominate LinkedIn, this is where I go. Mm -hmm. But now as we're going down, I like the way the first copy on top of the picture, just yeah. go to the top. Yeah. I like that, are you here for? Mm -hmm. Okay. I yeah. liked that. But now from there, I got lost because as we're scrolling down, there's an image that's going on and on, mm. and then we're lost. Yeah. So that's now a design issue. And then also she needs to put in a bit more copy so that we're a bit more, oh, this is for a form if you want me to come do an event speech podcast. Mm. And then we need to know, oh, this is for my show. This is a video bootcamp I have that mm. I'm offering because it's a bit... Um, you know, this is where you have what we call the, the curse of knowledge. You know what you mean, mm. but someone who's coming in like us, we don't know what you mean. So you have to be very careful about that. Yes. Yeah. And I guess also if she has multiple offers, like, okay, I'm, I'm using the website to target somebody who's interested in my LinkedIn uh, services. Compared um, to somebody who's looking for me to do a speech. Exactly. And, and compared, compared to, to somebody who's maybe just, I just want to see a podcast. Exactly. I want to see more. I want to see more. Yes. Um, so I think maybe that should come out very clearly. Like this is for you if blah. This is for you if blah. This is for you if blah. Um, 
and if you're in if you're already ready click here for blah yes you know think of the home page as the as i would say the reception area and also yeah. it's the signpost area it tells us where to go basically toilets are that way yes and <laughs> the yeah. offices are this way the yeah. accountant's office is that way we need to be guided never assume people know when they're coming assume somebody does not know it's yeah. like welcoming someone to your home they have landed in your territory you determine how you want your territory to look but for those who are coming in and they're not sure you need to guide them very well that mm -hmm. way they know oh i wanted your show that's what i want to watch today mm -hmm. or someone's like i really want this lady to come and do a speech at our event yeah you know so we need to guide all these people because those are different audiences yep. for instance those are three I know, different audiences for instance already. i know she's actually done speeches on youtube on stage and she's using a very strange photo i don't know if this is a stock photo or what but yet she's actually spoken on stage and she can just use her own photo of her on stage literally a screenshot of that youtube video and could just actually go there you know mm. and i think that would then be way better mm. um yeah and also if it's like the shiro bottom show i don't know i kind of like the ones people take in the studio or in front of the mic you know um i don't know i think that will also be a, a nice photo as well that you use there mm um this probably is a one that i'm not really sure what it's about um, and also i'm not sure is it her or is it a stock photo it's not clear yeah it's not pretty clear yeah it's not clear already yeah. she has wonderful it doesn't look like her. yeah already yeah. so she should use it she yeah. needs to use it more like yeah she has very nice photos with her mm. now on stage no by the this could have actually been up there yes yeah but she needs to orient people now properly Hmm. yes yeah other than that i think the call to action needs to be clear there are hmm. too many things you're asking she's asking people to do because at the bottom it's subscribe then i'm seeing social media buttons down there hmm. um which is standard but we need very we need to be very clear hmm. what do you want people to do i think actually the menu up here is a bit more clearer rather than even the rest of the home page um, because at least you can see oh these are the services so linkedin video bootcamp and then influencer agency so already i'm pretty it's very clear you can see she has an agency and also she has a program um, and then of course she has the podcast and also if you want to get her for speaking as well so i think actually up here it's much clearer than it is down on this home page as well hey let's check out her her board page I like her photos. Yeah, very nice. She's very nice photos. Yeah. <laughs> I think that's what's saving her website. Very, yeah. very nice photos. You yeah. know? Yeah. They make her feel like I really like this. Actually, lady. their boat page she is much better. Friendly. Yeah, their boat page is, I think, better. Though I think it's a bit huge, this whole photo. Um, it's taking up the whole viewport uh, up here. Um, Okay, big block blocks of words. Yeah, very big. This is really wordy, man. You know. Mm, good things being said, uh, but very the text is heavy. Yeah. What's saving her is her clients and the, the logos. Yeah, exactly. Because when you see this, you're like, oh, she's done a lot of things. It adds to her credibility. Mm. But the text is intimidating. Mm. I'm not sure. Do I want to start going in there or not? Mm. yes but the photos are very beautiful i mm. think that's the one thing i would say about this website very beautiful photos yeah yes mm. very though nice. of course down here maybe the text can be broken up a bit yes. isn't it yes this yeah. is where now design can help yeah design can really um support this area because with good design it helps to break the text that way people don't feel intimidated because also the beauty of most people by the way they write very nice things in their in their text eh, about themselves and there are very beautiful things that come in there but it gets hidden mm. you know and then it's lost in the world of words yeah yes people don't read the internet like a book that's what you need to keep remembering yeah yes hmm. cool 
Um, so I think I think you're actually pretty much done with this one, yes. isn't it? Yes. Yeah. So if you want us to review your website, um, feel free to get in touch with us um, um, in the comments. You can just drop, I think, your website in the comments and ask us to review it. And also, if you'd like um, to book a call with us to see how we can help you with either designing a website, redesigning it, or fixing a few little issues on the website, uh, feel free to uh, click on the schedule a call link. We'll also have it in the description. And yeah, so yep, I think that's it. Normally, I help people with website design. And, and I help people with their copy. Yeah. So yep. So until the next time, have a good one. Bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>